Uh, hi YouTube! This is Jason from Indiana. <laughs> As many of you know, I became an atheist because, well, <laughs> God wouldn't heal my acne. Well today, I'm going to take the blasphemy challenge. Ready? Okay! <gasps> I DENY THE HOLY SPIRIT! <laughs> God didn't strike me dead. Guess that means I ain't going to hell for denying the Holy Spirit, huh? I'm sure many of you remember the so-called blasphemy challenge from a few years ago, and how a lot of immature people like Jason here took it as a chance to show off. Well, past the laughability of that sort of thing, what exactly does it mean to blaspheme the Holy Spirit? Well, let me put your mind at ease while also showing up dumbbells like Jason. Hey! Sorry, chump, that's the way it is. You want to know the real unforgivable sin? Here it is. Yep, that's right. It's that simple. Here's a more detailed explanation. First, the Holy Spirit is God's active principle in the world. That is, the personified effect of God in the lives of people and in the world. Second, blasphemy involves the denial of divine identity, authority, or activity. Third, the one who blasphemes the Holy Spirit is essentially one who denies the divine authority and activity of the Spirit, which is what the Pharisees did when they attributed Jesus' exorcisms to Beelzebub, and why specifically what Jesus said on this subject is attached to the story. In a nutshell, the Pharisees denied that the work of the Spirit through Jesus had divine authority or activity behind it. In other words, they didn't believe what they should have about it. The Christian scholar James Dunn put it this way, Now in terms of today, after the resurrection of Jesus, you could apply this a couple of ways. Some would say that blaspheming the Spirit amounts to denying the Spirit's internal conscience-like product to become a believer. Or you could make it more broad and apply it to denying that the Spirit as God's active principle in the world actually exists and does things, like raising Jesus from the dead. Either way, the bottom line is the same, unbelief. Aw oh, man, I just made a stinking video too. It's already got like two views. Aw oh, man. <laughs>